Oh, nice place you got here. Oh, yeah, it's easy to mock, isn't it, huh? Cheap and fucking easy. <laughs> but uh, this, this here is my place, and my work paid for my place. All right, relax. I was just being sarcastic. Yeah, well, don't be, all right? Because the world doesn't need any more sarcasm. It's the blight of the age. Yeah, I get the point. Come on. You're driving us up to the bank. Let me call Lester. What now? We got a funding problem, so we need a job. Before the jewel store, you talked about a score, a, a bank in the sticks. I need you to meet us there. Polito Bay, right? That's the one. I'll get on a bus. All right, Lester's meeting us there. Don't start. I won't. No way. Good call. If you're taking down a bank for a few million, first thing you do is call the hospital, tell them to get you a guy in a wheelchair. Oh, this Hayseed Bank, you gonna be carrying that kind of change? Local law enforcement extort money from all the weed farms, whorehouses, meth kitchens in the area. They keep their cash in safe deposit boxes. Then there's all the normal small town payroll stuff. We should do well. You know, I've been thinking about you, Trevor. Your lifestyle. Oh, have you? Really? Yes, I have. People always try to label you. You know? Maniac, psycho, friend, industry leader. Well, in some ways, you defy categorization. But then... What? Think about it. Where you live. Sandy Shores, you precious ass. I'm sorry there ain't a place nearby for you to get your colonics. Right. But why? Are you out here? It's off the grid. We're away from it all. It's somewhere real and authentic. This is America! And real people ain't been priced out yet. Yeah, well, what if it gets gentrified? Then I'll fucking move. Okay. What about the way you dress? What about it? I don't give a shit what I wear. No, no, no. If you don't give a shit, you wear clean clothes that fit. So yours are all a little out there, you know, a little wacky. Whatever's in the shop is what I get. Jesus, what, what is this? It's not an absence of taste, T. It's the opposite of taste. You should be a stylist. And then there's the tattoos, the hair, the weird music, the funny toys, the niche drugs, the everything. What the fuck are we talking about? You? are a hipster. What? You're a hipster. I hate hipsters. Classic hipster denial. I abhor hipsters. I eat them for fun. <laughs> hipsters love saying they hate hipsters. What I really fucking do? Self-hatred. Common hipster affliction. Why? Well, be because I'm living out here away from the bean machines and the bankers. You're gentrifying. Soon, the skinny jeans will show up, then the skinny lattes, and then the bankers. And you'll be somewhere else, starting the cycle all over again. Maybe you're not a classic garden variety hipster, but you're what the hipsters aspire to be. You, Trevor, are the proto-hipster. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. I don't agree with what you're saying. You're talking bullshit. You're trying to wind me up. But I'm very, very angry. And I want this conversation to stop right away. The bus stops up here. All right. How long does it take us to get out here from LS?
Come on, man, knock it off. What? Yeah. I'm gonna break your fucking fingers, you don't knock that shit off. Well, please, all right? You'd alleviate the boredom. Ah, finally. Hey. 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 Welcome to paradise. Come on, car's this way. It's dry out here. Don't worry, brother. Mark will take care of all your moisturizing needs. Mm. Oh. Shall we? Might as well get started. <sighs> okay, let's take a look at this bank. And we'll go to the front of the bank, clock the entrance. If the paperwork's correct, the alarm will be a relic. We should be in and out before the local PD knows what's happening. <laughs> That's the entrance to the bank. Nothing special. They take us around back. Okay. I like it. Man, the place is remote. It's got the right amount of foot traffic. This'll do. Mm -hmm. It's not ideal. It's gonna cost more to break that system than the score is gonna pay. Well, then we're gonna have to find a new score. No, 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 uh-uh, no. This is the score. What are our options? It's a dumb idea, but we could trigger the alarm. See what kind of response they throw out. That is a dumb idea. Hey, you heard the man, all right? Shoot the sucker. Okay, I brought my police scanner to drive over to the gas station opposite the bank, and we'll monitor chatter. All right. Services frequency, we have a code 30 Adam. Alarm going off at Blaine County Savings Bank. All cars in the area, please respond. Polito cars 3, 6, 9, and 1 will be there in 50 seconds. Roger that. Four units. Backup team at station is available. Uh, they've dispatched four cars in 60 seconds and more on standby. And it isn't even 30 Victor or shots fired. Oh, this is a real headache. What do you got on the clock? 40 seconds. This is Polito Security. Any updates on the Code 30 Adam? Backup ready to mobilize. This is not normal. The response is out of proportion. Cops in this county are dirty. And the alarm just went off on their piggy bank. This is them. What is that, a 67 second response time? Yeah, four cars. More in the wings. Bad cops, garden dirty money. Fuck how many? We can take this. Wait right here. We'll see if anything about their routine suggests a weakness. I'll pay you back when I get paid. Polito Radio, this is Polito Car 3. We have a code tomorrow. 12. False hey, alarm. Bro. Possibly triggered intentionally. Roger that. We're gonna set up checkpoints on the Great Ocean Highway and the Sonora Freeway. Car to car searches and record checks. Checkpoints? Searches? Fuck this! I ain't getting caught because Lester needs a wheelchair. Hey! Wheelchair! Or not, we're still faster than your ass. Well, I'm not gonna outrun a cop. We've gotta go. We're going. And we're in front of Trevor. He'll be the one running. Ah. Hipster! Hey! 
Wheelchair or not, we're still faster than your ass. I'm not gonna outrun a cop. We've gotta go. We're going. And if we're in front of Trevor, he'll be the one running from the cops. I shouldn't have come. I should have known. We're fine. We're gonna get out of here. Trevor Phillips, of course this would turn into a car chase. We're not being chased. Not yet. Not at all. Look, take a deep breath. We're gonna be fine. We just gotta get back to Trevor's office. Get off the road up here. This must be Trevor's route through the mountains. Ah, dirt track. Might get bumpy. When Trevor says office, he really means... A burnout gas station by the Alamo Sea? I've seen the title of ownership, and judging by the glassware he ordered a year ago, I'm guessing it's a meth lab. A meth lab! Just perfect! Laboratory don't do it justice. It's more of a shithole where meth is made. Great! Nothing like a pharmaceutical bakery to prep the perfect stick-up job. Don't worry. It's gonna be fine. Look, you had any ideas about the bank? Are you sure we can't disable the alarm? The alarm is a UXVF-111 classification. Minute-long relay interval, third-party verification, multiple monitoring centers. Sure, I can disable it. But? But it'll cost more than the job is worth. Of course. Of course it will. So, what do we do? We walk away. It's not like we need the money. Uh, about that. You been day trading? Looks like the road takes a dip and a turn after that bridge. Slow down. No, God no. I mean, yeah, 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 I've been trading, but no, that's not why we need the money. Okay, then. That's not why we need the money. Then why do you need the money? <laughs> All right, so. There's this research laboratory on the coast. The IAA... Okay. ...are using it to manufacture a poison gas that they're gonna release on U.S. soil in order to hope that the government increases their funding. Well, that sounds idiotically improbable enough to be possible, but what's it got to do with you and Trevor sticking up the Blaine County Savings and Loan? Agent Steve Haynes needs two million plus to finance a raid on the lab. And guess who's doing the raid? And guess who's paying for it? Ah, I see. Yeah, well, I don't really see. But I'm doing it. And it sounds like Trevor would hit this bank for candy and a pat on the head. Now tell me, can we do it, or do we move on? Now you can do it, but you can't do it clean. How messy we talk? Taking the cops head on, messy. Well, they are dirty cops. That's what Trevor says. So do you think we can do it? Oh! you think we can do it? Guys out here aren't trained like the LSPD. They aren't going to be prepared for a well-armed, well-drilled team coming straight for them. Yeah, well, we need an edge. Something to tip the odds in our favor. Yeah, I got a couple ideas. <laughs> All right. Bullshit. Trevor beat us here. Yeah, well, at least we weren't arrested. Shit! Jesus, what took you so long? Had to let you win. <laughs> Set up a board over here. Oh. Michael, man, your blood sugars are low. I'm making you some leftovers. I'm fine, T. Huh? No, I'm the host, man. You know, I don't want you to get hungry and moody, all right? Then you're gonna be making the wrong decisions. Man, I've been making wrong decisions my whole life. That's how I ended up here. Here you go. Bon appetito. Jesus Christ, Trevor, what is that? What's wrong with you? That's just a... a what? An eyelid. It's probably not even human. Unless that gas station job. Gentlemen, some plans for your attention? Oh, good. I'm gonna stay here a minute longer than I have to. So I think our little uh, experiment showed that the response will be too quick to beat and too strong to walk through. That means you gotta face the cops head on. Dirty cops. Uh, the dirty cops head on. Head on. Man, 
I don't know. Well, you'll be prepared. Convoys carrying military-grade hardware pass near here to get to Fort Zancudo. I propose hijacking one and using the equipment to get an edge on the locals. I can get you the exact details of the shipment as soon as we're done here. Anyway, you won't be outside the bank too long. Polito Bay is, well, it's a bay. So you're a street away from the water where Franklin can be waiting in a boat to get you out of there. I know none of this is ideal, but it's the only way I can see of taking the score and providing for your FIB paymasters. Fine. We need personnel? Just a gunman. They'll be taking on the cops with you, so my advice, choose someone good. Yeah, think about my buddy's chef, okay? Consummate professional. Gus Moda. He's a pro. Not much else to say. This really the guy you want? That should do. I'll get the equipment together. Michael, you reach out to Franklin. Trevor, mm -hmm. you do what you do. Roger that. I'll call you when we're ready to move on this. Mm, you want to bunk with us? I mean, it's going to be tight, but, you know, me casa, su casa. I, I'll get a motel, thanks. All right, suit yourself. Fine, I'll give you a ride. Adios, amigos. Hmm? Franklin, buddy, what's up? Hey, look, there's these redneck dudes been looking for you, homie. Some angry motherfuckers. I found where they stay, man, and I've been following them. Okay, well, it's gotta be the O'Neill brothers. <laughs> What's left of them? I'll pick up Michael and we'll come to you. T, hey, man. thinking about it. I'm not quite sure if I'm ready to accept an apology. Where is my wife? Patricia doesn't want to speak to you. And frankly, neither do I. I will find you! Okay. Well, I'll put some coffee on then. I'll see you soon. Hey, Jimmy, it's your dad. Listen, if you get this, can you give me a ring? Tell your mom, too, will ya? And Tracy. Please, son. Your daddy's been a bad boy. Uh, please, son. <laughs> you want a sniff? The fuck is wrong with you? Oh. <laughs> now, see, the way I see it, this country was built by and for gasoline. So I'm just trying to prove my patriotic duty by, you know, doing this stuff. Oh, man. It's cheap, but it's good. Gasolina? No. <laughs> wow. Sorry, Mrs. M. Jesus. Mikey, you want a beer? Oh, shit, I'm sorry I don't have any low car. Uh, fuck oh. you. Uh. So where'd you two go when you went out, you and your boyfriend? Why do you care? I don't care. Just trying to conversate. Well, I was out putting some people in their place. Ah. You know, there's more to this gig than just going crazy all the time, killing everyone in sight. Just because I like the life and you feel guilty about it doesn't make you more of a man than me. And you know what? Deep down, I know you believe the bullshit, the picket fences, the fucking happy endings. And your street philosopher bullshit, that's gotten you real far. Oh, yeah, you've achieved perfect balance. Balance? <laughs> you've gone. Man, ten years in the sun, your brain has melted. You, you say words that have no meaning. What is balance, huh? Huh? That I fucking kill only on the weekends. So Monday, Wednesdays, and Fridays, I'm doing yoga and meditation. Tuesdays and Thursdays, hookers and sticking up joints, huh? You call me mad? Fuck, compared to you, I'm the sanest motherfucker I know. <laughs> oh, yeah, oh. sane, 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 sane. Oh, okay. I am so fucking sane that I should open a fucking mental health clinic. <laughs> okay, yeah. Yeah, fuck, now you're gonna stop being an asshole? I don't know, but I'll try. Well, that, I like your honesty on. 
I uh, spoke to Franklin. Why? Unlike you, he hears that his homie's having trouble, right? And he has no problem coming to help. So you're ensuring that we lie low? Out here? By calling L.S. and inviting a known accomplice of ours you know to what? come out here, what, for a little visit? That is so fucking typical of you. So typical. You don't even ask about the trouble. You instantly think about yourself. You're right. I did do that. I apologize. It's not good enough. I'm leaving, huh? I might die. I hope you're happy. Right. Hey, I'm coming with you. No. Yes, I am. No. If nothing else, then to get out of this fucking dump. You're not going. Have fun, boss. Oh, I'm going. Make sure you don't. Don't fuck stay it up. out too late. So what is Franklin doing for you anyway? He's tailing some guys, Mikey. Tailing. If he's back in Sandy Shores, why didn't I hear about him? God damn it! Shit! They see us, man. We gotta stay on. That's right, Chop. We gonna fuck him up as soon as Trevor get here. Hey, man, me and Chop on these punks. We coming up to WH, north of Chew Miles. All right, all right, the O'Neill brothers are coming to us. I think they was about to send one of them anti-tank rockets into your Vespucci condo when one of your roomies told them that you was gone. Okay, so if you're on the WH, that means you'll be coming through Ratton Canyon, right? Shit, I guess. Good. Me and MT are going to take the company chopper and meet you there. Company chopper, yes, Michael, it's a tax write-off. Frank, you still there? Yeah, I'm just about holding on to the road. We're taking the chopper and we'll head you off. Deal with these business stealing pricks on the road. Hey, dog, can you, like, get on it? Because these dudes is rolling hard. We're five minutes out from the chopper. All right. Shit, shit! Hellfire! I got your back, homie. Find him. Oh, shit! Trevor, man, shit, you there? There was a deer in the road, man. These motherfuckers crashed out. They crashed? They dead? No, nah, they gone. They ran into the fucking woods, man. I need air support like right fucking now. Don't worry. Incoming. Incoming? Man, you're all business. Yeah, well, this is kind of important. These men don't like me, and they know we're back in the sandy shore, so... Here she is, the Biz Alley. Remember, she ain't mine, she's the company's. Hey, hey! 
We here on the ground. Them hick dudes in the woods. That model's fitted with a thermal scope. Look for their heat signatures. Boy, we closing in. Whoever Phillips in the trees can fuck itself. Get him, chop fuck his ass up. He who ain't heard the last of the O'Neill.
feel good, huh? Helping a friend in need? Come on, Chop. Come on. Oh, yeah. Taking out some hillbilly crank dealers on a blood feud. That's what I live for. Hey, Trev, man, we gonna borrow this and head back to town. Sure. Come on, Michael, man. I'll drop your ass off on the way back. Chop, get in. See you back at Casa Phillips, Mike. Yeah, thanks for the warning.
alert! We did it! Lester the molester, bro. We got ourselves some military hardware. It's parked out back in my office. All right. We might be ready to move on this thing. Meet me up in the lab. It's, it's, it's not inappropriate. It's, it's another one of your fucking disasters. That's what it is. First you take a hostage against my advice, and then you start some kind of crazy high school romance with her. Are you nuts? She's, she's a 60-year-old housewife. Wow, she's 57. And she thinks that I'm mature. Yeah, well, let me tell you something. 30 years of marriage to the world's angriest mob boss oh. would make anyone insane. You're not making my situation any easier. Oh, there's a surprise. I knew it would become about you. I miss my family. Oh, you're full of shit. All you ever did was ignore them. And now that they're gone, you miss them. Fucking incredible. I'll tell you what's incredible. Fucking incredible. Hey. You mother... Hey! What? Enough! You got me out here. You wrote me into your crazy world of bullshit. If it was lies, new age shit, and arguments about how good life used to be, I could have stayed my ass in Los Santos. Hello, Franklin. What's up? All right. Here's the shot. We're going to Palano Bay, and we're going to do this thing. Any questions? Comments? Yeah. I miss Brad. That crazy motherfucker was with us now. He would have loved this. Instead, he's got to enjoy himself molesting white-collar criminals in a federal penitentiary. Thanks for sharing. Anybody else? What about me? You'll be waiting for them by the river, handling the getaway. All right. Now, these three go in, they grab the tape, they rendezvous with you, and you get out of there. Is that a uh, work for everyone? Great, let's go. Come on, we got a score to take. You ever hit a bank before, Franklin? Yeah, I was the driver on the job my boy Lamar pulled. Guess it's the same kind of shit we doing now. Right? Nice, bro. What was the take? Shit, I don't know, man. I can't remember. Come on. Everyone remembers their first score. Uh, shit, not me. Huh? Mikey, bro, what was your first bank score? 88, outskirts of Carcer City. Took a small franchise for 10G. Yeah, things were easier back then. Yeah, 25 years ago. Jesus! You, generic goon. What was your first bank score? Okay, we're doing this? Uh, Robin slash Preston Khan, I guess. Let me think. First real lick. Uh, all right, yeah, armor car. When we spoke down in these floors, know what I'm saying? They had it coming. Ah, so how much you take? 200, thousand. Oh, big dog. First time out. Had to send most of it up the ladder, yo. Repping Bagos, homie. Yeah, so that was when I went independent. Man, I hear you on that one. Hey, your turn to share, kid. I told you I don't remember the details, man. Leave him alone, Trevor. This is an important moment, Michael. Here we are, on our way to almost certain death, bonding, pouring our hearts out, and this guy is sitting here, soaking it up and giving nothing in return. Hey, if he don't remember... If he don't remember? I'm supposed to trust this man with my life, and he don't trust me with the details of his first bank job? Well, how about you? Why don't you share with the group? I'm here. I'll back the facts. The check's cash place? I went in, took him for eight grand, walked out. Hey, hey what? Ah! It was a bit more complicated than that, though, wasn't it, T? Maybe I knew the guy. Maybe he ID'd me. Maybe you did oh, six months. Shit. Maybe I was out in four, and that, children, is why we don't leave witnesses. That, children, is why you don't rob people that you know. <laughs> ah, Franklin, share. Yeah, come on, kid. It can't be worse than Trevor's. All right, man, shit. 
Okay. The score was like two stacks, man. 2G? Take home on your first gig? Fuck, that ain't bad, man. Man, the whole score was two stacks. Only I didn't see none of that shit. Die pack went off, home. Money was useless then. Die pack? <laughs> you amateur! I knew I shouldn't have told you shit. Hey, Franklin, we all gotta start somewhere. Last time I tell your ass something. Ow, come on. <laughs> Don't be so cold, man. Learn to laugh at yourself. You're in danger of turning into this man. Who, me? Yeah, you. Wouldn't laugh, wouldn't hang out. Uh, I've got my work, I've got my life. I never do something. If we're risking our asses, we gotta be family. How about that, die back? Man, fuck you, sense of humor. Hey, let's just do this thing, all right? All right, Frank, we're gonna drop you up here, okay? When you hear it kick off, Get ready because we're gonna get ready because we're gonna wanna go ASAP. Mary. I'm gonna get away, man. I'll do it. Alright, you know where you gotta be? I got it down. I'll bring a die pack just for you. We ready for this? I could use a restroom break. And risk getting ID'd. You're an idiot. I gotta go! Number two. Yeah, we'll pinch it off. All right, we all good? Let's hit them. Let's do it. You're this is stink up. This Get on the ground. Oh Today's going one of two ways, friends. Oh. Everyone oh. on the floor with the psycho. Now. You and you, out from behind the counter. That's it, hands in the air. M, keep an eye on our trusted employee. Okay. Hey, you got the crowd. Cops should be here soon. So keep an eye out. The lock is down. Keep the door open, M. M, you gotta kick this door, man. If I ever meet this alarm guy, I'm gonna fucking shoot him. Not if I get to him first. Yeah. Stay back! We got hostages! Shit! Tell the sheriff the 211 is confirmed. We're gonna need everything we got down here. Lay down your weapon! We're coming here, we don't have hostages! I thought we needed hostages! Sheriff's here. We never could have beaten that response. There's other ways to beat that. Move it! Call up procedure! You know you're surrounded, so you ain't getting a ride to the airport! I don't care if they surrender. I'm killing me some bad guys. Now let the hostages go, and, uh, we'll talk like gentlemen. Time to face the music! Ah! <sighs> 
sweet mother of shit. Don't be dumb like that guy. Fuckers! Shit, minigun! Are you seeing that? Remember, here's where we make a stand! Stepper! You humorless prick! Look out! It's coming down! It's coming! Hey, this cop's in the way. I'm gonna get out this way. You hear that, guys? Shit! We aren't getting out on the water! We're not going through this, not with 50 pounds of gear. Blast it! Bring the fence out! Oh, you, homie! This is it! Let's go! The fence, bro! Unleash hell on it! Over there! Lay down your weapon! We need another escape route. Can you find a vehicle? Something that might stand up to gunfire. There's some construction around the way. All right. Well, we have ruined someone's lovely home. Man, the only thing your crib's missing is a pool with a burning helicopter in it. You got some more of them. The troops are here. Too bad. Get yourself up. Keep going. Up here. It's too heavy! You wanna play dead? We won't be playing! Hey, hey! Through here! Right along! Ah! Fine! Ah! The army was dropped too? Gosh! Shit! The fucking army! They called the army! You're being a dumbass, soldier! We ain't need to fight you! More army? This is why our defense spending is as much as the rest of the world combined! Stay your foot, soldier! M! T! They're flying a tank in our direction! Oh shit! And we really gotta go! You just go! Link up with F! A push is what- You fools really been making a fucking mess out here. You okay? I ain't dead yet. I'm on my way. Hey, what about them? How many dudes they got in this private army? So I guess we shooting our way out of here. Trevor, wherever we go, drama follows. That's one way of putting it. Hey, hold on. Sweet mother of me. Shit! That's that tank that flew over us. We gotta duck into that factory. That tank don't look too friendly. Uh, let's go inside, regroup. You shot old man, huh? Group just fine. Man, y'all look hot in the motherfucking suits. Hey, we got a train to catch. You're in the way! They're all over us! Come on, through the warehouse! 
Use me as cover, Frank. You don't want to get out front. I'm starting to feel underdressed, dog. Back it up. Find some Stay behind me, kid. I got the armor. Friendly, Agent Sanchez. Our very own corrupt G-man in training. You gotta be careful, buddy, all right? Because they are uh, looking around these trains for illegals. And if you're mistaken, you'll be shot, amigo. Very amusing. Yeah, if you expecting them two to bring you up, you're gonna be disappointed, homie. Right back at you. Got the money? Everything we got. Okay. And here's your cut. Considering present scrutiny on public worker remuneration, this is a big win. Oh yeah, it's a huge fucking win. Woo! Monsters. I'm out. Agent Haynes will get in touch with you once Operation Save the Worlds ago. Catch your crew together, okay? Fucking punk. All right. We should probably split up. They're gonna be looking for a three. Oh, the blood we spill for the security of this country. Come on, Franklin. Man, I'll holler at you home. Hi. Seat up. Serious. Fantastic.
Welcome back to Los Santos, Michael. I'm sorry you won't be alive long enough to enjoy it here. Hey, call your boys off. I'll make it good. Come on, man. I just want some wheatgrass. Great homecoming. Los Santos has missed you, Michael. So have my boys. How many you want to lose, Martin? How many? As long as you die, it really doesn't matter. Hello. IT guy. What's up, bro? Look, I know you aren't still fixing computers for a living. When are you gonna throw some work my way? Hey, if you're right for a project, I'll be in touch, okay? Okay, but don't forget about me. Fantastic.
What brings you in today? Better than new. Perfect installation. This will give me some more zip. That car was a woman, I'd guess her. These tires are hardcore. got great taste. Thanks. There's like lots of stuff everywhere.
Let me know if you need a hand, okay? end up here. I've clearly made some very bad decisions. Trevor about? He's probably out somewhere drinking human blood or eating household pets. <laughs> He's not that bad. Really? Well, okay, he is pretty bad. But he's got a sensitive side. Oh, yes, he's very sensitive. When he gets his feelings hurt, he's devastated. So what's your story? I ain't got a story. I'm an independent thinker. Living out here, away from the man. From what I can tell, you're like a high school athlete. Living off old glories. You used to be able to manage heat. And now, you're worried if your loafers are getting scuffed. Any more bullshit comes out of your mouth, you're gonna learn all about my past glories firsthand, you understand? <laughs> Absolutely, sir. That came out wrong, all wrong. Tell Trevor the monthly train is coming through. What monthly train? The monthly train. Where have you two been? Getting some fresh air. Talking of beautiful things. <laughs> yes, I hear Stockholm Syndrome is very nice this time of year. Well, hey, watch your mouth, boy, all right? It's always been a dream of ours. The train of dreams. The hell are you talking about? I'm talking about gold. Enough to keep Ron in trailers and you in therapy. Enough so that we can pay off that Mexican and get you back in town, oh. baby! Yeah! Oh, this better be <laughs> fucking good! Oh. <coughs> oh, Jesus! Fuck. Ah! Oh. Man, we've talked about this hygiene thing before, bro. I invite you into my home, this is how you repay me? It's like living with a fucking horny skunk. Get a boat and meet me under Rat and Canyon Bridge. I'll be on the earpiece. That's about the size of it! Make it a fast boat! Ah, the logistical mind of Trevor Phillips. So, it's like gold bricks on board, right? Sometimes! This is a high-value courier service run by... <laughs> Merriweather! Oh, Merriweather? Tranquilo, Mike! This ain't a weapons train. It's goods too valuable to insure for air travel train. Gold. Sometimes gold, sometimes artwork, priceless antiquities. Sometimes enough for you, me, Ron, everyone. Fine. And here she is, a magical train. Stop that train! Mike, oh yeah, another thing for your shopping list. We'll need some bombs. Okay. 
I'll pick him up when I'm back in the trailer. Back in the trailer? Where are you? We got work to do. Yeah, yeah, I know. That's why I'm getting changed. Wow, whoa, whoa, whoa. getting changed? What have, what have you turned into? Conductor on this train? You on the water? Sure, just caught a fish. Let me know when you need me. Got it? Eat it? Be under that fucking bridge. When we go past Polito Station, whole of Merriweather's gonna be on to us. I'm living the life, my friend. This is quite a spot you pick. Enjoy it now, because it's about to start raining fire. Train to steal. Don't be smart. Find the loot. Our moment of judgment. It's about fucking time. I'll be as quick as I can be. I gotta run a fucking salvage operation in here. Merry weather recovery teams arrived. You take the more guys I gotta kill. Hey, you sure about this cargo, man? I gotta keep looking. Hurry it up, man! I ain't found nothing good yet. They got shooters on the track. Go. I ain't struck gold or art or anything yet. Hold them off. Baby on board, we're good to go. Above fucking time. Come on.
Get in, let's go! Down river! Vamino! on our tail. You feeling alive? Juice pumping through your glands? My glands are just fine. Without the crashing train. You change clothes. You couldn't have done this without that weird vest thing. Somewhere we can pull up just down the coast. Whoa, man, you work hard for your living. Boil it down for me. How much you think you make for a senseless killing, huh? Couple nickels? Times are tough. Have been since we put you in the ground. Hey, you had your savings. That I couldn't access because you blew the identities. You know, there was nothing for Brad's defense. Man didn't even get a trial, just popped up in Supermax. Ron organized some transport for us. Oh, his and hers, huh? Because of your independent spirit. Hey, 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 hey! Hey, before you go, show me the loot. All right. It's perfect. Perfect for fucking what? For squaring things with that Mexican psycho. We give him this, and you end your relationship with that little lady. 
Maybe we won't be dead men in Los Santos. I don't fucking see that Silicon City again. It'll be too soon. But this is my job, not your call to make. Nah, nah, your job. Fuck things up with the Mexican to begin with. My job, my score, get your own. Wait, you give me that case, I'll give you something bigger. What? Union Depository. Fuck off. Can't be done. I never said impossible. Just very difficult. Virgin suicidal? That a line you're afraid to cross? Come on, T. You remember the dreams? A couple kids pulling jobs, the big one. I know, it sounded crazy back then, huh? But hey, you and me together again. With Lester and Franklin on board. We can do this thing, T. This ain't no dream no more. Yeah. You keep the case. Fuck me, okay, hey! All right. Here. Keep that silly fucking thing. And you can keep Patricia as well, all right? Because I respect that lady and I ain't gonna hold her back. <sighs> Thank you. Just remember, I'm gonna be keeping my eye on you every day. Inch of the way, all right? Of course. And if that bastard fucking cheats on her one more time, mm, I don't know what I'm gonna do. You know, Trevor, we both know you're not the marrying kind. But hey, it's great to be back in business, huh? Let's bring it on. The big one! The big one! Townley's on the line, too. Hey, Trev. All right. I need your whole crew over at Cape Catfish. We're moving on the chemical weapons plant. No, 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 no. I just gave something to Lester. I need to deal with some stuff, get back to Los Santos. Just, uh, give me a week. We got the equipment with your Polito money. The gangbanger's already on the way. The window's open, my friend, and you are jumping out of it. Shit. Shit! Los Santos ain't going anywhere, bud. Ridiculous. Lester better play it right with that idol.
Agent Steve Haynes, man.
gonna strip the screw there. I can't put the cap on. No, it's a nut, man. You just screw it back on. Hey, what are you doing here, citizen? I said, what are you doing here, citizen? Nothing. Oh, I'm sorry. You're clearly a tourist. For our friends from up north, eh? A boot? <laughs> Don't even say it like that. There's a moose loose, a boot to hoose. Fuck off, you hoosier. Hey, hey what's that? Hey, fuck hey, sense! Oh, Jesus. It's a faint hey. fucking accent. Get out of here. You can hardly come on, tell. Come on, hey, insurgent, shit. insurgent. We have contact. We have contact. Terry has to offer. Canadian? Whoa! 
Terry has to offer. What are you gonna do? Waterboard me? I was in the Air Force. I served my country.
Hey, I need a cab. No problem. I'll have one there in a couple of minutes. All right, thanks. Where can I take you? Sure thing, man. Brother, here we are. Ever heard of Jackson Skinner? He's head of product development at Facade. Man, we must read different magazines. And the bastard made a fortune selling customer data to the highest bidder from Moscow to Tehran. He's handing it to the cyber terrorists on a fucking silver platter. Okay, dog, chill. Shit, chill. I got you, man. What's the play? I'm reliably informed that he has a weakness for working girls. There's a regular he likes to pick up in La Puerta. You stake her out, and she should lead you to Skinner. I'll send you the location. Meanwhile, maybe I'll take another look at the fruit share price. <laughs> All right, homie. I'll be in touch. Damn, that must be my girl. Hey, what up, girl? You won't get down? Not today, honey. I'm waiting for someone. Whatever. You ain't nothing. I'm out of here. Hey, baby, what can I get for 10 bucks? You can get the bus home and jerk off thinking about me. Get the fuck out of here.
Hey, baby. You miss me? I was starting to think you weren't coming. Oh, I always come. Aw, you're such a smooth talker. Usual spot, baby? Works for me. So how's things? My landlord kicked me out, and I ain't received a cent from any of my baby's daddies in like three months now. Check this out. I just made number five on the Tech 100. Wow, that's great, honey. Great? How is number five great? How would you like it if someone called you the fifth best whore? It's a disgrace. That's what it is. I play to win. That's my thing. Fuck fifth, idiot. I'm sorry, honey. You haven't told anybody. Have you? What's this guy's problem? Ride my ass. No, seriously. Is this device? Set me up to fucking kill you. Oh, I'm gonna demean you like the dirty slut you are. You got the money? Have I got the money? Who do you think you're talking to? I got four houses. I own a fucking island, bitch. Okay, okay. Take it easy. Just relax. I know how you like it. Real dignified. You know, I don't even feel bad about it. Hey, man, I wiped that software for you. Ah, excellent news. I'll speak to you soon. Eat me! You fucking idiot! Hey, can I get a cab? Not a problem. A driver's on the way. Thank you. Hey, hey! Taxi! So, where do you want to go? Santiansky Mountain Range. I'll get you there fast, buddy. Come on, let's get going. You bet. Here we go. This is the spot, right? Hey, what's up? Oh, hey, man. How you doing? Man, I was wondering, have you heard from your family? Yeah, sure. No, that's a lie. I haven't heard a fucking thing. Damn, that's fucked up, man. Yeah, well, it's not gonna matter. We're all gonna be dead in about a half hour anyway. What's going on, ladies? Hello, Trevor. What kept you? Business, Michael, business. Uh, all right? I'm the CEO of a big international corporation. It's very time-consuming. Nothing, of course, you'd understand, being a gentleman of leisure. Oh. You know, you know, Franklin, <laughs> if there's one thing that you're gonna learn from being around us... Please it's just... fucking insanity. Then they can't fry you. If you want something done, go to the busy man. This rich fuck is useless. Oh, oh ho, hold on, man. Could y'all knock this shit off? Oh, look! Boys, your boys, it's the feds. Hey, where's the other three? What other three? We told you to bring along six. This is a six-man job. No, you didn't. You Dave did. No, Dave didn't. You said you'd do it. That is a frickin' lie. I do not get things wrong. All right, great. Then we're out of here. Uh, uh, Fuck uh, it. Uh, uh, Let's go. You three can do it alone. And die. Fuck you. You do your own dirty work. Hey, I do my dirty work every day, keeping the country safe from scum like you. And you're doing a great job, sir. Hey, you want this job done? Then come with us, huh? Come on! Come on, Mr. Leisureware, Mr. Depressed Accountant! 
Let's go save America! Who the fuck are we saving it from this time? This is the real deal. My sources are convinced there's a plot in international affairs, you know, the agency, and they're using this facility to make a serious nerve toxin. <laughs> Bullshit! Yeah. Which they plan in their mind-blowing insanity to let a major terrorist release on a metropolitan area so they can continue to get funding. Nothing increases funding for fighting terrorism more than successful acts of terrorism. <laughs> all, right, so, so, all right, so let me get this straight then. No, 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 there is no getting it straight. That's the point. Now we're doing this. You two are on getaway. Fuck off and make it happen. Michael, you're with us. What size flipper you wear? Agent Norton, been a while since you were in the field. The sight of you in neoprene is something we save for our worst enemies. Shut up, I'll be fine. And you, get in. You're driving. Go down the coast. The facility's a few clicks south of us. Listen to me, Steve. No wisecracks, got it? No fucking cliches. We're fighting for the freedom of the people today. Don't lecture me on patriotism. You've been living outside the system too long. Social responsibilities, a joke to you. So maybe I redeem myself, get killed in the process, huh? That old bullshit. No one is dying on my watch. Not even the burnout bank robber with temper issues and nothing to live for. A hero's death is too good for you. You'll die in the ignominy you deserve. Oh, thank God. Fate shall carry me safe through these selfless acts of charity. This is the bay. We can get in through the discharge tunnel. Here goes. Be a great over the outlet. Townley, you've got the cutter. When we get there, go to work punching through. Roger that. Taking the oxyhydro cutter to the grate. That's burning at over three and a half thousand degrees. Yeah, thanks for the science lesson. Can I keep this for the next vault I hit? That gas won't last forever, so cut smart. So, you 
You got any more little facts for me from the instruction manual? Thought you'd want some intel on the equipment we sourced using your hard-won funds. Ha! <laughs> I figured it was all gonna go on a wardrobe full of windbreakers. Oh, and maybe some nipple clamps. turbine nearly there that's an air pocket take it up to the surface people I was born ready. Let's do this. Come on, Dave. What's the plan? Hey, hey, hey. We locate the toxin and action our escape strategy. That's what we got. Great. Lead the way. Bank robber, set your phaser to stun. Dave, you're on point. I'm leading from the rear. Move it! Please, now! Drop it! Okay! Now hit the elevator! So what exactly does a neurotoxin look like? You're on a need-to-know basis, bank robber. Shut it. Elevator's coming down. Someone's on board. Out, out, out. Yeah. Collect a swipe card. How you feel about this? I feel pretty damn fine. Yeah, if only your camera crew was here. 
Eyes right. Stay on top of this. We're fine. Move on. Two lab geeks. Gotta deal with them. Put them up! They're down. Let's go. Along here and to the left. Don't sit there. Bring it to them. Behind the wall. Security detail about to make a pass. They're on us. Make a judgment call. I dare you. Just a little pinprick. What can a pinprick do? Ask the monkey. Go on. A tiny amount on your hand. <laughs> okay. We're clear. Swipe us in. Come on. There's a lab rat in with the toxin. Let's do this. Door, now! I'm not coming out! Door can only be triggered internally. What's that? I'm on it! You! Hands up! Back up! Back up! And freeze! We get collateral! You want a bargain? What's nerd face worth? Open up! The special agents have the door. Go in there and secure our nerve agent. This'll make me... the most dangerous man in the country. I'm also the most shit scared. Oh, man. Thank you, federal government. The toxin is volatile. We need to get it into a refrigeration unit. Warning, facility has been breached. Facility has been breached. Before the sell by. Okay, steady. Uh, easy. 
she done it, Em. Just as I was getting used to having the apocalypse in my pocket. There you go. Phillips is on his way. Good. Get this thing ready to move. I'm just a couple of clicks out. Is the package ready? Package is ready. Get over here, man. I can't believe they spent the tank from the Polito job on this chopper. The flying pig rig. And we need a flying big rig right now.
Hey, Frank. It's cracking, man. So the chemical weapon in there, right? If it even is a chemical weapon, hell, it could be shaving cream for all I know. By the way, next time you're getting wet. Oh, but there won't be a next time, will there, Davy? There never is. I'll do my best for you. I always try. Yeah, well, maybe this time we'll get lucky. Maybe this time Steve will succumb to the strains of enhanced interrogation techniques. Interrogate him? Are you insane? They're probably decorating him right now. Hey, Davy, your boys at the agency are on to you, remember? Ah, huh? you and Stevie. Just try and keep your heads down. Yeah, putz. I had a wonderful time, Trevor. But we both know I made a vow to my husband. <laughs> I know! You have a great pain inside you, but you... Trevor! Look! You are a beautiful man. I've never been so happy and so sad in my life. You have a beautiful way with words. For some, for some reason, everyone I love abandons me. I am not abandoning you. I am going home. Treat you! I know. I know. No. Stay. You better treat her right, man! I will, amigo! Yeah, otherwise... The other ear! Of course! Uh, the way I see things, you and me and Michael, we're, we're friends now. Uh, good friends. Such good friends that we will make a great effort to avoid one another. That's fucking perfect. Uh, thank Michael for this statue. It is exquisite. Yeah. Yeah, I will. with you.
miracle did you want me to perform? You have any problems, you bring her back to me. Look, it's sharp. Just looking at that engine gives me a hard on. You got great taste. If that car was a woman, I'd kiss her. This will give you some more zip. You mean business.
Should be running better than ever. Now that's a custom job. That's a beauty right there. Now that's gonna be a smooth ride. Look, it's sharp. They won't shoot these out. Anyone home?
I need to borrow your car, lady. Oh, no, no, no. Forgive me. Fuck me. Me, we. Wait. Citizens report. 480. Ah, just in case I wasn't having enough fun already. miracle did you want me to perform? You got great taste. That'll boost the door. If that car was a woman, I'd guess her. Can't go wrong with a little extra under the hood. me business.
Shit! The big empty house. Man, I love the internet. the magic touch? Good to go. Now that's a custom job. your perfect suspension. There, that should give you a boost.
These tires are hardcore. If you're driving around Grove Street, you should be just fine. This car costs. Anyone home? That wait.
You got lucky, buddy. Seriously, I woke up on San Vitus Boulevard running away from the cops in my underwear. Yeah, that shit was not just weed. You got any more? See you at the gym. What are you doing today? Good to go.
looking sharp. If that car was a woman, I'd guess her. Hello. Yeah, can you send out a cab to me? I'm sending one out right now. Thank you. Hey, my man, where you going? Sandy Shores. Come on! Okay, buddy, there you go. You come through me, or you take your chances out there. I need a cab, pronto. Stay where you are. I got a driver right around the corner. Good work.
Where can I take you? Sandy Shores. This is the spot, right? They got a hard on for someone else. Yeah, I'm an old fuck. fat ass fucker with a gun. Come on, then! <laughs> 